Greetings everybody, welcome back to another episode of Serious Curious Adventures in Eins of Ara. Last episode we found a secret entrance here to the tower probably. Where the uncle was always working at, so let's go check this out. Can we open this? Yeah. Uh, yeah, might as well go to here first. Oh, we're on the other side of the main room now. Great. And there's the shield we probably need. Aha. Uh -huh. Can we like... Oh yeah, we can rotate these. Okay. I have to go to the other side. Uh, wait. No, no. We have to bring it to the other side. Okay. Yeah, because I don't remember what the symbols were over there. I didn't write those down. Uh, okay, what's over here? Lots of crazy stuff. Oh, I don't know. I don't think... I don't think we can do this yet. Don't know anything about that. And then it opens stuff and there's some things in there. Yeah. Uh, do we need to turn anything here? They all probably have to point at one thing. So this one can point at all of them. I'll leave it on this. For now. Because we have to rotate these things eventually. And the, the light probably has to shine on them. So we're missing the... Oh no, we're missing the middle one. So this is actually going to be this one here. And then this one can go into the middle. There. So this beam will hit this. Uh, this beam will hit this. The third one here. And then the fourth one here. Whenever we can rotate that or whatever. Okay. More coins. And even more coins. I actually got most of them already. And there's a spooky hat. I might have to go through some of the other rooms and see if there is a hat there as well. I might be missing some of them. Ooh. Okay, conversation between the inhabitant of Sirius and that of Saturn. After his ex, ex uh, after his excellency uh, let, laid himself down to rest, the secretary approached him. You have to admit, said Micromegas, the nature is extremely varied. Yes, said Saturn, uh, Saturnian. Saturnian? What a Saturnian. <laughs> Nature is like a flower bed wherein the flowers, ugh, said the other, leave off with the flower beds. The secretary began again. Nature is like an assembly of blonde and brown haired girls whose jewels. What am I supposed to do with your brown haired girls, said the other. Then she is like a gallery of paintings who features. Certainly not, said the voyager. I say again that nature is like nature. Why bother looking for comparisons? To please you, replied the secretary. I do not want to be pleased, answered the voyager. I want to be taught. Tell me how many cents uh, the men of your planet have. We only have 72, <laughs> said the ac academic. And uh, and we always complain about it. Our imagination surpasses our needs. We find that with our 72 senses, our ring, our five moons, we are re too restric uh, restricted. And in spite of all our curiosity and the fairly large number of passions that result from our 72 senses... We have plenty of time to get bored. I believe it, said Micromegas. For on our planet, we only have almost uh, we have almost one thousand senses, and yet we still have a kind of vague feeling, a sort of worry that warns us that there are even more perfect uh, beings. I have traveled uh, a bit, and I have seen mortals that surpass us, some far superior, but I have not seen any that desire only what they truly need, and who need only what they indulge in. Maybe someday I will happen upon a country that lacks nothing. But so far no one has given me a wor uh, any word of a place like that. The Sat Saturnian and the Syrian proceeded to weird themselves out in speculation. But after a lot of very ingenious, ingenious and very dubious reasoning, it was necessary to return to the facts. How long do you live? said the Syrian. Oh, for a very short time, replied the small man of Saturn. Same with us, said Syrian. We always complain about it. It must be a universal law of nature. Alas, we only live through 500 revolutions around the sun, said the Saturnian. This translates to about 15,000 years by our, by our standards. You can see yourself um, that this is to die almost as the moment one is born. Our existence is a point. Our life swim is in, uh, an instant. Our planet an atom. Hardly do we begin to learn a little when death arrives. Before we get any experience, as far for me, uh, as for me, I do, I do not dare make any plans. 
I see myself as a drop of water in an immense ocean. I am ashamed, most of all, before you, of how ridiculously I figured it. Uh, I figure in this world. Whew, crazy stuff. But like, mm. that's got kind of interesting. Like when, uh, oh, is this gonna be important? Because you can reread it. Well, maybe just so you can reread. Um, yeah, because it's like, you know, some of us. Ooh, hello. Feel like life's too short, right? You can't do too much. Okay, they're gone. I wonder if, like, if you really could live, like, thousands of years, if you would still have that feeling of, like, oh, life's way too short. I could do so much more in that time. Or if there would be really a time where you, like, you know, feel like, okay, that's <laughs> that's enough. And I mean, like, you know, you would actually stay young and healthy, I guess, through all these years. You wouldn't be, like, old... For 15,000 years and couldn't do anything. Um, oh, this is cool. I like this. I like these flower looking things that open up like this. It's really pretty. Okay. This is very magical. I got a magical orb. Alright. <laughs> I'll take it. To wherever. Wait, wait, wait. Actually, let me have a second look. Uh, nothing on the ceiling. Just want to make sure I don't miss anything. None of these creepy heads or something. No? Okay. I think we're good. Uh, I don't know. I don't really know where to put that light. Uh, oh. Did it go up there? No. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's maybe go back. Because we have a shield now. And we have, in this room, we have the solution, probably, for this puzzle up here. So it was um, down. This way, up. And left. No? I wonder if you have to start at the top. Maybe I'll do this one more time. Just go through in an order. No. Or maybe... Oh, wait. Oh, I did something. Ah, it just waits for you to back out so you can't just... Try all, all kinds of combinations and then, you know, automatically complete it, I guess. Okay, fair enough. I like that. Okay, that's probably the way back. More coinage. I'm missing a lot of other things, though. Oh, this goes back. Okay, what's this then? Oh. That's not spooky at all. Going all the way down there? Oh, hello. Okay, I guess I'll go down first. Ooh, solar flare. Oh, solar... What do you call that? I know the German word, I don't know the English word right now. Solar eclipse. That's, that's, I think it. Oh. I'm like in the sewers or something. That's a lot of treasures. Okay. Oh, I can't go down from here, though. But So it's just like... You open it from here, and then you go down there from a different way later on. Mm, anything else? I think that's all. Don't see a creepy head in this room. Okay, let's go back up. We got that collectible, at least. I haven't looked up yet if they are useful for anything. Uh, I mean, there must be, right? But like, if it's something super, super valuable. More radio stuff. I wonder if I'm supposed to find something. Could turn it off, though. <laughs> it's really annoying. I haven't listened to radio in a long time. It's all Spotify now. Still have, like, 
I have like a um oh it's one of these dolls. I have like one of these like alarm clocks that plays music from your iPod and stuff, and that one actually has a radio built in, but I don't use it a lot. Mm. Okay, that's just for the radio, I think. So maybe there is something with these. I don't know what though. Hmm. I'm gonna ignore it for now, but I'll try to remember that there's a radio here in case we need it for something. So let's go back and uh, what do we have? Oh, the shield. Right, 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 right. And the light. Oh, maybe the light goes into here, actually. Maybe? I don't know. No. Strange. Strange thing to have. So we have four of these. Yeah, and I might go through the other rooms and see if I can find them. Okay, so it's... Uh... I guess it's just mirrored, right? Oh man, these can be really precise though. Uh, this one's pointing outwards. This one is pointing like this way. And this one is like this, okay. Oh, zoom in first. Nice. Ah. Uh, this might be what we needed for that picture puzzle downstairs. Okay, I'm gonna write down this thing up there. I don't think I'll write down the whole <laughs> star symbol. Uh, actually, maybe I need to. Three of these are not lit. Oh. Oh, wow, okay. That's what that is. Alright, never mind then. Don't think I need to write down the other stuff. Alright, let's go through some of these rooms real quick and have a look if there is one of these creepy demon hats that I can use. Don't think there is though. I feel like I would have seen them because so far I've seen them all. When, well, well, at least I think I saw them all, I guess. Uh... I'm gonna have a look anyway though, I think it might be useful to do. Like this room I could totally see having it missed. Cause there's a lot of stuff going on in here. And I didn't ah, I didn't check the ceiling either. Okay. They're all pointing up. And then back out. And something falls out. Is this just a statue? Oh yeah, it is. Okay. So we got all of those. We got a lot of them. Okay. Still looking for the demon head, but I don't really see any. Probably have to do more in that other in that other area with the um with uh the, the kitchen and stuff. Okay, back at the very beginning. Ceiling? No. Well, we found both of the things we saw so far, so... Oh! I missed that one! Shoot. I guess I... <laughs> I will miss something sometimes. Okay, let's go back in. Hmm... Yes, this thing is really weird. Don't know what's up with that. So let's go back into this room. Can I figure this out? I mean, is it the same as the thing downstairs? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I should have written it down. Uh... Nothing else I can activate here, right now. Okay, I'm gonna go back to the room and check it out real quick. Oh, find another picture, at least. Yeah, I, I checked the uh, the star sign does not have anything to do with... Uh, oh, and there's a demon head. Okay, 
I only need one more of them. Uh, with the thing to spin, I think we need that button or whatever to do this first. There's also still this, which I don't think we've seen the code anywhere. Um, so maybe I really just have to find all the demon heads for now. So we can get into that room. And since I didn't find any of them in the old rooms, I don't think. Did I? I don't think I did. I'm guessing that I have to go through some of these other ones here on this area to find them all. So we actually only missed one now. Uh, so I don't know what that could be, though. Hmm. I didn't see one in this room. Or did I already had it activated? There may be one, and I'm just blind. Oh! There's something. Oh, just a picture. But still, it's cool. Only missing one now. I'm just still trying to find these demon heads. Because I think that's the only stuff really that could move this forward right now. Oh, wait a minute. We can do this. I think this is what we saw in the... Ah, I see. Yeah, this is these paper scribbles we found. The thing I saw thought was an X is actually two triangles here. That's why one of them was like a square on the other side, which is this one here. Ah, now it makes sense. So these go down and then this goes to the right. Nice. Ah, good, good, good. Progress. Because <laughs> I'm I've been running through this place for several minutes right now, and I had no idea what to do. Uh okay. A sword, a bike, a ha what is this? Weird. I guess they may go on to these things we saw in the other rooms. Those pedestals. Okay. Yeah, I still need to find one more head, but I don't think I can find it. I'm pretty sure I looked at every single wall I just went through. Do they go on here? Oh, they don't. Well, mm, unless it needs to be like the right symbol, but what would it be here? I don't know. No, I don't think it's this. Oh. Uh, no. Weird. I have... I have no idea where these could go to. Three pictures. Maybe this actually isn't helping me at all. <laughs> Yet. Uh, oh, this is where I came from. Maybe I do still need to find that head. Let's go into this room. Uh, yeah, I don't think... I mean, you know, I wouldn't go in here or anything. Hmm. Because we have actually... I think there's three of these. Maybe four, I'm not sure. Where would I put that? Can't go onto this table anymore. Ooh, I'm at a weird angle here. Wait a minute. This is a different angle suddenly. How do I do this? Flame Nebula. 2024? Maybe the code? I'll just write this down. For the chest. I don't know. Oh, this might be important. So these are the things we're collecting probably. The three down there maybe. The stars in the Orion's belt. Al Nitak, the easternmost star, is 736 light years from Earth and is actually a triple star system. The primary star, Al Nitak A, is a blue supergiant with an apparent magnitude of 2.0, making it the brightest star, uh, brightest class zero star in the night sky. Al Nilam, the center star, is the bright blue supergiant. 1340 light years from Earth, with an uh, apparent magnitude of 1.7, it is the 30th brightest star in the sky and the fourth brightest star in Orion. Anilam is surrounded by vast mo molecular cloud. Mintaka, the westmost and star, is 1200 light years from Earth and is actually a binary star system whose star orbit each every 
5.73 days. Together, they have an apparent magnitude of 2.23. All right. And it's Orion, the hunter. Cool. That's weird that I could go in here. Yeah, the poster might be important then. I'm surprised I got this weird angle here. I don't know how I did that. So, uh, okay. Does this reveal anything else? Super weird. I can't mess with these things. Okay, so the chest was... Uh, I think... Back here, actually. And then through this door, and then this door. Let's try... See if that code works. Two... Zero... Uh, two, four... Oh, shoot. Hey, Star. <laughs> I'll take you with me. Very nice. And here's one more of these things. Yeah. Mm. Maybe it's supposed to be like star symbols, but no. Weird. Okay. Well, let's go enter this. Maybe it does something. Maybe unlocks something. Otherwise, I'll be stuck again. Uh, yeah, I'm in this weird angle now every time. Strange. Okay. Now we have two. There's nothing with this, right? Can't rotate this or anything. That's just Orion, I guess, the shape or something, the symbol. Huh. Well then. Where do I go next? This painting has like the same shape as these, kinda, like it has this ornament on the side. I wonder if the flag, because we actually have a flag here. Is this gonna help? <gasps> ah, so you need to write, you do need to write symbol before you put it in there. Okay, okay, okay. So then here, where was that thing? I thought there was one here too. Maybe, oh, maybe it's in this room only. So here, we need to find oh, the, the guitar. Okay, I see. Uh, let's zoom in first. No, maybe, maybe it's not the guitar. Uh, because that's not the right picture frame. What was in this book again? No, it's not going to be this. Uh, am I looking for a picture that's, like, put away? It may have been over there. It's the same room. But it's, like... It's, like, in a, it's like on the other side. Oh, no, here it is. So, the windmill. Okay. There it is. I got it now. Okay. There's that. And that goes also in the main room, right? Yeah. The other one was on the other side here in this room. On the window. Oh, but we don't know what it is. Ah. Um. Well, maybe that's a trick. Oh, there it is. The dagger. Or sword. Alright. Did that open the door now? Nope. Uh, maybe they'll unlock these things in here. Nope. Oh, yeah, yeah, it did. It did. Aha! That's what we needed. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. Ooh, look at this. Oh boy. Okay. Something to figure out. Oh boy. <laughs> okay. It's also this drawer, but I couldn't open it yet. I guess this will open it. What even did we get here? A picture frame. Oh, this goes maybe into the picture that didn't have a picture. 
That'd be kind of funny. Can't take this out. Can we open this drawer here? Did we already open this drawer? Or maybe it opened... Oh, wait. Okay, there you go. Oh, this is the space thing. Turn it all the way. That's a picture and a picture and a picture and a picture. And a dial as well. Okay. And this I can't open. See, this is the picture. Nope. Nope. Okay. That doesn't go in there. Still have one more, which is over here. Ah. Oh god, okay. So this is Orion, right? Is it? No, I don't think it is. It's shaped differently. Uh, let's see if I can somehow arrange this. So we need two big stars there. Oh yeah, it does deform a little bit depending on how you rotate it. Oh, it's gonna be interesting. I'm guessing it has to be like those big stars or something, right? Like this? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what it is. And another picture, another dial. That I don't know what it does. Oh, this is a big one, so maybe you put this in here? Oh no. Can I combine these? I feel like this will go in there, but I guess not. Hmm. Let's go into that other room with that empty spot. I want to see if one of them goes in there. Not this one, not this one, no, okay. Interesting. Oh, I thought it was, oh, it's, I think it's this one. It was like a zoom in icon. Okay. Huh, okay. Well, it's something to figure out, but I think we'll have to do this next time, because the episode is getting long. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys soon. Bye-bye.